I want your perspective on the lawsuit. Do you think it's, it should have happened in the sport? Because there is, there, is there is a conversation there for sure. And obviously it's not his lawsuit, but let, let's keep it real. Like he could probably be like, hey, don't do that or do that. I know he has that power because he's been in other situations where he has the power to kind of dictate how situations play out. Let's talk about... And I can call let's, Brennan. Let's talk about the idea right now that in this world we're seeing complex situations. We don't have to specifically call them out. Okay. The internet wants me and you and you to give a very simple answer for this right now. Yeah. Digestible. Nah, he shouldn't have he should have made sure that lawsuit didn't happen. He he had no right. She had no right. The other people on the other side, Dylan had no right. She has the complexities. God, if you even knew the complexities of the situation that I, that I can't even speak of, bro, that are, th th this is not simply man upsets dude, dude tells girl to file a lawsuit. That's not what happened here. Or, or dude didn't do enough to make her not do it. Bro, there is a relentless attack on a person's character, which is attached to a brand which supplies revenue for a woman to, to survive. There is, a, there is a fight going on that has to build you know, attention for. There is a, an enemy between Dylan and Logan that exists outside of the fight. There's a, an enemy between Dylan and Jake. There's an, an enemy between Dylan and JJ. There's Dylan trying to build clout for himself. So when he loses this fight and all of this goes away, he still has a couple people that give a fuck about what he's doing. The idea that this is some binary A, B, black and white answer is, yeah. is just like everything else on the internet, fucking stupid, yeah. right? So, so here's where I'm at on it. It was relentless, relentless daily abuse of a non-opponent in the fight. If he had done it for a couple days, dropped the seed in Logan's head, y'all got some shit on your girl, and, 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 and that had started to affect Logan's feelings about the fight, whatever. The, the issue that I think she had and they had was that when it became an everyday 24-7 assault yeah. on someone's character that, by the way, was completely defamatory, spun out of control, mislabeled. She, he was taking pictures of dudes that were like gardeners. And, and giving it the overall ex appearance and propagating this rumor that she fucked 100,000 people. Yeah, that's yes. When it turned into this soap opera is when it went off the rails. And I think Nina had to make a decision for herself to protect herself, to protect her brand. And now here's the question. You're Logan. New, here's another factor. Newly engaged to the girl of your dreams, okay? And you have to go into this massive, extremely public battle deciding to yourself, do I support her decision? Do I support a decision that supports my life? Do I support a decision that best supports me in the fight game? What do I do here to satisfy the 90,000 factors involved in this extremely complex scenario? So when you sit there and you ask me to provide you an answer for where I feel, how I feel, I come at it as a 38 year old man who understands the complexities and natures of this world that, that the 20 year olds and 12 year olds that support this shit don't yeah. get. Yeah, I get it. I mean, it is, it's far, far more complicated than that. I understand. Do you that. feel me? So is it yes or no? <laughs> sorry, I had to, sorry. No, no, no. I had to do it. Cause no, they'd be I, pissed I if I didn't that. do it. I, respect I think that. it's also different from a girl's perspective, what she's being put through and her brand image. It's terrible. It's so bad. I remember me talking about it, seeing it on social media, talking about it with my girlfriends. Yeah. We always think like, poor Nina. So I, I go, like, I'll she play. She did not deserve that whatsoever. I got to play the 16 year old. Uh, ad, I got to play the devil's For, other side. I hope you okay. do. So it's so, because like, they're not here to say it. So they're going to be like, who cares? You're married to Logan Paul. He's going to be a billionaire. Deal who with cares? it. She I'm cares not saying this is true. She I'm, cares about her reputation. I'm just, yeah. I'm just, I got to put it out there. Sorry. I, thought about myself no, it's not. a little bit. I think that's why I got I know, it's not it. <laughs> but that's the thing. That's that's see what you just said, which is so interesting. That's what every person literally watching the show will take. Will take like a perspective and just like, you know, if we talk about the younger generation, like they're not gonna be able to make 
like really conscious, like, is this the best choice for that guy based on this? And like, they don't know. They just see what someone's saying on Twitter. This chick's this, just six that. And that's part of the whole problem, right? At the same time, like their level of understanding of the whole situation, how actually complex it is and how like, cause to think that this girl is not somewhere, wherever the fuck she's at, I'm assuming in Puerto Rico, I don't know what sure she stays at with Logan. She's, she probably was going fucking through it. She's probably I'm, devastated. She probably thinks about it 24-7, I'm right. telling you. That's what I'm saying. But, like, the people watching would have no real understanding of what that would be like. They just Because they're just a part of the, the throwing the shit or, oh, my God, reacting, whatever. So it's so, it's so much more than yeah. just that. And the girl, it's not like you went to a church and found a girl. She's been in the industry forever. Of course she has pictures with men in the industry. Yeah. Like, even me, if you... If you look it up i'm sure i have pictures with you pictures with larry wheels like all of these and then you put the assumption behind it they have a picture together they've slept together like it's devious it's, de it's, it's devious it's, it's so devious. malicious yeah, it it's, it's to me it's what i terrible what i started to see because i i'm not gonna lie at first i was like this shit's funny i'm not gonna lie in the beginning i was like this is funny and then at some point i was like oh, this is a lot that's when he should like, have it's stopped. a lot he should, when it <laughs> like, was funny to people he should have stopped it well, and that, it would but that's then it no just lawsuit. so here's the other side of it it just became the whole fight was like him versus nina and then going to fight logan paul that's what it started to feel like yeah and then i was like wait a sec like where where where, where do we go from here like is it and that's why i think the other side responds in this way and they're like fuck it just just fucking hammer it because now it seems like if this guy loses the fight or wins the fight, it seems like he's fucked a hundred percent, almost like, not forever, but for a very long time. D Dylan. Dylan. Like Dylan's won. No, like Dylan's fucked, and then also at the same time though, this oh. is the interesting thing. Logan wins obviously after dealing with all this, whatever. I don't know what's going on in personal life because I can't speak to any of that. But the fight is like I'm gonna watch this fight literally because of how much bullshit I would have watched it anyways. Cause I would watch Logan fight, but I think there's so many more people who are like, so, so invested in it because that guy went a fucking miles and miles. I hate ahead. to admit it, but I I'm watching it because of how it came up to be. And because I want to see Logan like destroy. No, for happens. sure. Oh no, like, no, 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 no. So I there hope, is to say Logan's no, making yeah. so much money. Yeah. I yeah, hope nobody out there is no, but he would give it all, he would give, he it, would all give it all back. He for, would give it all. He back, has money. Bro. Yeah. It, so, yeah. so that's the question. My question is, do you think, knowing what he knows now at this moment, he would have not taken that fight? I don't think I don't, he would have taken the fight. I 100 don't think he would have taken the fight. Holy fuck. I don't think he would have I don't taken the fight. I don't think you, Bradley. Even, even if, if, wow, even for the bag. Bradley, if no, you were in that no, situation no. and you had a girl you cared no, about, you would, not, you would not have no, taken the fight. No, and by the way, I can say uh, with 100% certainty, without any doubt, when he looks and 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 has to feel partially responsible for how this has played out. He, he would not fucking take the fight, bro. Damn. He has to, he has to, bro, like, like, bro, nobody wants to see, nobody wants to see their significant other being, being ridiculed like yeah. that, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, regardless of like how he feels about it and the shit that comes out of it between them. Like, I mean, I, dude, like, Dylan did it to me even on the tiniest fucking scale. Like he found pictures of my, the chick I'm talking to, like dumbass, like picture of her at the club with like a dude with champagne bottles. And like, bro, this girl's a fucking, just a normal chick who like, you know, like you said, yeah. everybody has these pictures. He even, and then, so he posts these funny. and everybody starts, I didn't give a fuck. fuck, but everybody starts retweeting the picture. Like, you know, Mike, Mike found another washed up, ran through. You know what I'm saying? It's the narrative they put behind a damn well, picture. Well, because that was they're, tw they're 12. And so and so the, the, the issue is that wasn't enough for him. So Dylan started posting pictures that weren't even my girl as retweets with my picture of me and my girl making believe that it was my girl. Just a random couple. Yeah. And everybody was like, he got another one on him. So it's just like fake shit. It's just fake stuff that so so like where I was on it was a little bit different than Logan. First of all, I'm immune to that shit, bro. You ain't gonna come at me and tell me that the girl I'm talking to has bodies. Yeah. Are you crazy? Yeah. Are you insane? That I, I have one immunity in that in this life. Yeah, and you're it's the, that you're the king of burying the bodies. Dude. You ain't gonna yeah, come yeah. at me and be like, oh, your girl got bodies, homie. My, I, I've dated girls that got graveyards, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like you're not gonna come and post a picture of a chick with a fucking champagne, a dude with a champagne bottle next to my girl, and I'm gonna have like a, a, a reaction to it. Yeah. So yeah. I'm in, laying in bed with her in fucking Newport, Rhode Island after a wedding. We're cracking up about it. But she's got people texting her. This is the thing. People texting her from Miami personally. Like, yo, what's the deal with this? Were you fucking 
whatever this dude's and she's like bro this, see this is the shit yeah that you deal well, that, with that's also exactly. the difference is, is that it's that logan is is fucking probably like you immune to the shit mm, is he's no? not okay. he's not that's the that's the difference because logan's a logan's a i'm a different beast bro i came on the scene said yo i'm a i'm an imperfect man i make i've made poor decisions i still do i'm a i, I you know i i enjoy you know very strange luxuries of this world and some fucked up stuff. And <laughs> I've grown out of some stuff and I still don't always make great decisions. By the way, I used to smoke crack and I'm a felon and you know, like I'm a, I'm, I want you to look at me and be like, yo, I know a homie like this in my hometown. He's not, he's not a bad guy, but he's not, his, his head ain't perfect. You know yeah, what I'm saying? He's been there. Logan's not that. Yeah. Logan's not that Logan is Logan is a, a global brand. And so when you start to, when you start to, rock that ship with lies and deception and and create a storyline that's that's not true and it affects the brand of his partner but also by the way kind of affects his brand yeah they because do. you're calling his love into question and his decision making into question as to who he chooses as a partner yeah. mm -hmm. so so it's it's just like i said it's just a very complex well, gonna, situation what bro. i was gonna say to that at, after that point i mean i think Overall, though, it's probably safer to say he's a little more like immune to it. Maybe not as much as you, but his girl is probably not at all because for sure. Because I and this is no disrespect to Nina. I, I've never met her. I don't know her. Is that she? I didn't hear about her until all of this. So it's like for me, she's probably not really so so in the space. And to be in it in this space in this way right now is like it's it's just like honestly, all things considered, the way the internet is right now, it just seems like. If you're getting hung out to dry now, overall in all industries, on all social media platforms, people are, the, it feels like the most like divisive and like vicious than they ever been.